I hope everyone's having a good day. And uh, I've been playing a bit of Korax lately. Uh, just it's a fun, it's a fun deck. It's not easy to play him right now, but it's fun. Doing me some good results. So uh, yeah, we'll see what's what's up. Let's jump into it. And Iota. Okay, all right. I can deal with that. I can deal with that. Let me know if the sound's fucked or if the music's too loud or if the you know the effect of the game are too loud or something. Let me know. So let's get rid of. Let's actually keep you in. We're gonna keep that hand here. All right. They have a lot of small troops that are very annoying. Troops that are you know can fuck us a bit. So. We'll just go ahead. That's good. We want that guy here. We're going to be aggressive. That's not a matchup that I want to uh, last too long, right? So we'll be aggressive here. And uh, we'll see what she plays. Good. We're uh, just going to kill that right away. That, that will stealth us at the same time, so that's good. We started first, which is good, but not that much. I would have loved to go second here for the stun. And also, she gets a precognition, which can be pretty annoying, because now this is not as useful as it could be. So, uh, yeah, we'll see. We will see. Hey, what's up, Dishmael? How you doing, buddy? I hope you're having a good Sunday, bud. Uh, see now, she played Crucial Choice. I'm thinking just dropping that guy here. It's pretty annoying. And we go face, alright? We'll see what happens. If she kills it, that's fine. That's totally fine by me. We still go face. See what's up. So, yeah. Let's see what she does here. It's a pretty cool curve back. I have the same one. I think it was March, was it? That was a weird play. Why did you... You're afraid that I unstealth this? That is weird. That is quite weird. Okay. Uh, you have options here? Definitely want to do some damage to you, and we want to drop another one of these. We'll use you to get some damage in. There's no point in keeping that uh, or healing me or something right now. We want that to go as fast as possible. We'll play that. We'll use Curse of the Raven at the same time just for the extra damage. This goes on two health, which can be killed with a bunch of our things here next turn. If she doesn't kill all of her stuff, we're going to be doing a lot of damage next turn, so that's going to be good for us. Let's see what she does. Yeah, that's fair. Create one seal. Put another one. Okay. Uh, now, see, this is interesting. I can get rid of all of those. Or I could keep going and put down some adequate damage. What I'm thinking here is actually using that and kill those. But that would be a waste of a turn a bit, I feel like. But I don't want her to gain too much seal. So we're going to play safe. We're going to play safe. We're gonna get rid of those. Uh, yeah, get rid of you. Uh, we're gonna take some damage, but that is fine. That is fine, boys. All right. Again, if there's something wrong with the audio, just let me know, okay? I'm still counting you to this. Oh, uh, that was good, okay. You're gonna kill both of those, probably, yep. At least that's only one damage to my face, so that's not too bad. This is good, we like that. Uh, we go face here. There's no point really in using those right now without a uh, sentence here. I could drop one and not attack with it, but there's no real point at that. So we're just gonna keep that. That sucks, that's a bad turn for us. But, you know, sometimes it'd be like that. Now, if she drops something big, I can absolutely sell it. So that's, that's, that's pretty good. Hey, what's up, Fedrex? How are you doing, buddy? Yeah, good luck on ladder. Thanks, man. Uh, we'll see how it goes. Should be pretty all right. It should be pretty all right. Yeah, okay. See, now we're gonna go. We're gonna go in and get some damage in. Okay. Use that. We don't want another tail turn. So now I'm pretty sure she put that on one of those. We're just gonna hope that it's not the one I'm gonna use. Okay, fine. Good. Now she's on 7, which is not great for her, so we'll see. We will see what happens here. That's fine. 
Now she's gonna give me Kent attack, probably. Yup. We could stealth here. Oh, okay. Even better. Now we're just gonna do that. This dies, that's fine, that's amazing. Uh we wanna keep doing damage here. So that next turn we can actually kill her. And we're gonna put that as bait too. Okay, let's see what we get here. If we get lucky, that could be pretty cool. Let's see. Uh, okay, that's fine. That's fair. Ooh, that's pretty nice. I'm gonna send that back to uh to hand. Yeah, yeah, I can't let that on board, and I don't want to spend a ton of shit on it. That's good. Okay, so we save sell it. Do this, and we're gonna we're gonna use you to get rid of the shield here, and we're still gonna attack because we're very close to killing her. Now. Depending on what she does, she might be able to survive another round, but I might be able to stealth with this here if she doesn't kill it or whatever. Let's see what she's got. Yup, reading another seal. Now do you have a seal? No, we win. Okay, we uh, just use that to attack here, use the Torvex squad, or you know, we even draw lethal here. So uh, just not to get any damage, and there we go. So, first game in, not too bad, not too bad of a first game, boys. That was pretty good, eh? So, uh, oh, good player. That's a good player. All right, let's uh, let's keep going. Uh, the penguin guard, as I call them, uh, pretty good, solid. Oh, Jagatai Khan. That is not someone that we see often. That is definitely not someone we see often. Okay, we don't need the bikes here or the javelin, but we kind of want to keep Tarvik here because you know it's a good damage. Okay, Titan here, great. Only thing that can kill it, pretty much, is if he's using a target eye sacrifice, which could fuck me a bit. Thinking about whether I can get the top 50 before the end of the month, when I'm uh, too late and I can chill. Or is it too late and I can chill? No, you can definitely do it. Like, we're mid-month. We can, You can absolutely, definitely uh, do it. Do top 50 right now. Anyone that starts uh, now around 3k, 3.5k... If they, they do a couple of big session push, they can get into top 50 for sure. I, I wouldn't be surprised about it. I wouldn't be surprised. It's been done before. I've seen... Hell, even Troyanez, uh Troyanez, uh last... Uh, we're actually going to use you here. Want to be aggressive? Want him to spend the energy here? Uh, yeah, Troyanez won the Warmaster last season. And uh, he started late to climb for it. So anything's possible if you do good gaming sessions. Hey, dolls, there's a chance this is midnight. That could be midnight, we'll see. That could be midnight. I like facing him, he's an interesting player to face. He's got good decks normally, so that's fun. And I'll try because card bag... Yeah, the card bag is amazing. This is one of the best card back I've seen in this game, for real. Well, except mine, of course, but you know. I only wear gold, you know that, boys. Okay, so now it's gonna be Battle of Sneak Attack, eh? So, we're gonna use that guy here. Just so that he uses uh, some resources to get rid of it. We're gonna get some good damage too. Now, I could use counterattack here. Kinda save that, but it's got 3 health. There's for sure he's got tactic that deals 3 damage. For sure, so. Yeah. And you're gonna shoot it for 2 draw card? Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. We're gonna drop this guy here, see if he's got uh, sacrifice. We could both. Uh, he's probably. He's gonna get his reckoning for sure. I could get mine too this uh, this game if he keeps uh, removing all my shit, which is good for me. Uh, it's a pretty good reckoning in that matchup too. I think. We just need to get him pretty low. So now, unless he has target as sacrifice, he can't do anything about this. I think. Exactly. I'm gonna ignore that here. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna do damage here. I'm gonna ignore that a hundred percent. Uh. So we're actually gonna get the big damage here. Do that here, shoot him for a couple of damage extra. Yup. Gonna attack him more. And we're gonna keep counterattack again. I wanna keep it in, in case the, uh, you know, the game goes out of hand. So I wanna keep that, I wanna keep that for now. We'll see what, I, what happens, all right? Yup, that's fine. And shoot that. And you kill that though. I can take some damage. Yep, okay. So, that's fine. See? We, we got some great value off of it anyway, so that's amazing. We're gonna use Crucial Choice here, see what we get. This is, this is could be this could be useful, very useful with the bike I got here that is fast. So we're gonna take Protocol. We're gonna play this little guy here, just take some damage in that guy. 
Hit him. Can't go into Reckoning yet, because also he had a troop, so that's not gonna happen for another turn. Yep, okay, he's gonna, he's fishing for, uh, he's gonna get it, he's gonna heal a bunch. You use the frontline vehicle here, or he's gonna belt for, yep, that's fair. Can belt. We're actually gonna draw more cards. That is nice, but that's not exactly what I wanted. So we will just use that here. Cool. We'll use the Curse of the Raven. I'm just trying to fish for, well, that guy earlier would have been pretty nice. Do I have Lethal here? No, I don't, sadly, but I could. He's gonna Reckoning next turn. I will probably play that guy into Bikes, into Forbidden Protocol, and see what I get here. That could be pretty good combo. Like, he's a 9. I can deal 7. We'll see. We'll actually see what I draw. No, I might use my Counter Attack 2 next turn. He's gonna heal a bunch, yep. Okay, now we can't. So we're just gonna use that guy here, drop him, and we're gonna do a bunch of damage. So drop you, uh, we're gonna attack you, we're actually gonna stun you, I think. Because I don't want to take too much damage. Actually, let's keep it, there's no reason to use it right now. Uh, can I, I don't want to use, I want to keep that, everything to, uh, you know, kind of, actually, let me do some maths here, so that's four, seven, okay. We actually, we actually gonna bait him a bit. Want to kill that so that we can use the bikes to attack him. I could have stunned him here, but eh, let's keep it in case, like I said, the game, you know, doesn't go our way. So he's gonna have to target eye again. Okay. The only thing saving him right now is target eye. I'm pretty sure. But we shall see. We shall see. Got it. You're fishing for it, probably. Oh, some more damage. I'm still kind of safe, though. His battle honor is a bit annoying, though. I'm gonna stun him next turn, probably, to avoid taking some damage. Recognition is fine. Okay, so we're just gonna, you know, hopefully draw a tactic here. That's not bad. I could just drop everything, but I don't, I don't really want to do that. So we're just gonna do this. Hit there. We're gonna stun him and keep deliverance. This kind of sucks, but that's okay. I'm afraid he has another precognition, which he probably has. He only has six cards left, so... You know. Okay. Now, let me see. I can't quite kill him, I think. I don't think so. 4, 8, uh, 12, 16. No, I don't quite kill him. Uh, I have some options here, but I'm worried. I am worried. What I'm thinking is play this. Play 4 button protocol on it. Ward is nice, we like Ward. And, uh... Okay, I think that's a pretty good turn. That should be a pretty easy win for Pirate. Yeah, well, you know, sometimes I'm bad at math. <laughs> Gotta enjoy the little things, dolls. You can't always be doing those crazy plays. Don't worry about it. Now, the only thing saving him right now is Target Eye Sacrifice, which kills him. Kinda. As he's, he's running out of cards. I got some stuff here. I still got damage. Even if he gets rid of all my shit, I should be able to kill. Yep. Healing? Okay. More healing. And then you're gonna precog probably, right? From a network? Good job. Good job. Well played. Well played.
That was well played indeed. Can I survive another turn? I don't think. Maybe. Let's play that here on you. We're gonna play that guy here. Attack you. Next turn, I might just go into Reckoning to hide, so we'll see. I think he could kill me. Definitely could kill me. He's got another precognition in hand, that I know. Probably as he has the vehicle that heals probably another one of these. Healed quite a lot by Tiger Dial. Yep. No, I, now I got no choice but to go into Reckoning, so. Uh, do I have lethal? That's cool. So, back. Go into Reckoning. And we chill there. Now, you're probably use, gonna use your other prick on you. I should be able to still do a bit of damage, so we'll see. Are you losing this match? Well, you got the good stuff you needed at the right time. Also, I did, I did make a mistake earlier with the whole board there, but it's fine. Okay, so... Yep, that's game. I'm not losing anything. You don't know what you're talking about, though. I'm not losing anything. <laughs> you're losing. I'm not losing. <laughs> there it is. Hey, that was just to showcase some... Uh... Showcase some uh, reckoning. We don't see the reckoning of Korax often, so might as well, you know, just go for it. That was fun. All right, it was a good game. That was pretty fun. Ultramarines. Okay. Let's see what the Ultramarines got for us. Uh, we're gonna get rid of you, and we're actually gonna keep Guerrilla Warfare, and we're just gonna get Curse of the Raven back. <laughs> that was lucky. That's good. I like that guy for uh, this matchup. Gage can drop some ridiculous uh, Astartes and stuff, so that's very neat. Who's good for ranking now beside your Troll Marines? Uh, I like the Ward Bearers. I think Zardulayak can climb can climb really good these days. But he's not easy to play, that's the problem. He's not easy to play at all. I would recommend Ultra Marines, of course, if you want to climb fast and steady. I d they're really good right now, they're amazing. So I would definitely go with them. Okay, let's play you here. That's good. Hopefully, uh, you live another turn, but you might you might just jam it and you know get into it. So let's. That's gonna take him some resources though to kill it. I think so. Yeah. Okay, that's good. One of those gone. That's fine. And you're gonna oh you're gonna use counter attack so you don't get any damage. So that's fine. Or you just hit it. Could have used a counter attack. Well, I guess you be, you you prefer to save it. Uh, you see here. I'm thinking of uh, dropping that guy as a threat and to make him have to spend the resources on that. Obviously, we go face. We're going to use him anyway. Drop him there, see what's up. Uh, otherwise, if you don't want to play Ultramarines, uh, kind of hard. Like, there's a lot of Ultramarines, but it's it's pretty diverse except for Ultramarines right now. So you could definitely play something uh, around that. Knights, Knights are amazing. Could definitely play knights, a hundred percent. That's that card is very annoying, but he's low on cards now, so that's kind of fine. We're gonna play you, get rid of this guy. Can't live. And uh, we're actually gonna drop that one as well, just as a distraction, so that he ha he's gonna has to have to deal with it. We have things that will be able to make us draw, so we'll be able to cycle cards. So that should be pretty good. That should be pretty all right. Good play. I'm gonna use that to attack here. I'm gonna have to kill that. Well, okay. And you're gonna take the damage, okay, sure. Still low on cards, so... Let's see what we get here. Damage on your face, to everywhere. Pretty annoying. And uh, we don't, we can't kill that. Well, if I use Drilling Sight, maybe, so... That's probably what we'll do here. Yep. Just get rid of this guy. 
and hide so that we don't take damage from this. Next turn, I might be able to get another uh, Guerrilla Warfare. This guy, man. This fucking guy. I, I need, like, this is why I lose those matchups because I need to use so many resources to kill that fucking. I now I'm gonna have to use that guy into fucking. Can I draw for something that might not? Uh, maybe, but do I take the chance of letting that live? I don't think so. So we're gonna take the damage, sadly. I could have get uh, you know the uh, ill one damage wall board, but fuck that. Uh, Corswain is very good to farm below average players, but good ones won't make the mistake that you let. Yeah, well, Corswain, uh, I've seen some pretty interesting builds of Corswain. Um, I don't see him often right now, though. So, I don't know. It's, uh... It's a good warder for sure, but I don't know how the meta, with the meta currently, how, how, how well it would do so. Okay? Okay. Okay, 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 that's actually fine by us. Probably keeping uh, this guy here, getting there, and we're gonna keep that hand here. Just I get our reckoning lower. That's not an easy matchup, but it's fun, so it, it's fair so far. We'll see. Yeah, you're gonna buff him. You're gonna heal. Yep. If I could draw the uh, my more date end here, that would be amazing. If I could get my four or five, it would be great. Cool. Okay. Uh, that's really not what I wanted. <laughs> That is really not what I wanted. So, do I take the damage here or do I hide is the question. I think I hide. Just hit that guy here with the bikes and hide. If I could have gotten that guy earlier, that would have been amazing. But, you know, kind of get him late, so that sucks. You can't trigger courage. You can, though, inform a network gonna hit there hit me i might have to just go into reckoning now yep Oof, of that guy you're low on cards if i could get any skip cells or something maybe that would be good okay you're going all in you probably have well maybe not you're low on cards you need to kill that and just win by attrition i guess i can't kill that i just can't kill it which really sucks really really fucking sucks we're gonna have to go. Uh, we're gonna have to go in reckoning here, boys. Choice. Uh, Snowball, uh, Raven Wind, Corn Favor, Special Combo will win you many games, but good players are able to play around most of the game. Yeah, that's the problem. Uh, Corn Swain's really like you, you know what he's doing all the time, so that's kind of annoying. But uh, okay, you're gonna draw a card. Don't draw some stupid ass troop. Yeah, yeah, buff this. Buff it. Of the guy. Okay. Uh, what do I do here? I don't quite. I I, I can kill it, of course. Then I can't play this. But I can play you guys. But then you get courage. But I can't play you in the down board. Just do that here. Play you, do here. And let's try and control, control the board. Hopefully he doesn't get any troops there, so we'll see. But that's not, I don't think that looks too good. He can, pre, he can get uh, courage off of too many good things here. Can you do it? Okay, draw another card. Now at least you don't get to play Marcellus. Don't play another one of those. Deal two damage to old board, please. That would be kind of sad for me. <laughs> Come on. You'll, if you don't... Okay. Well, at least you don't drop another one of those team. Drawing a lot. He's cycling a lot more than me. Okay. Okay. That's kind of fine, really. Play you. Hopefully, if he's got Stellocked, I'm not fucked, but that's gonna suck. Because <laughs> this dies. This lives, though. But there's that. Yeah, there it is. There you go. Yep. And you're gonna buff it. 
Now, I really want to play this here. But I don't think I can let that live because I die. I think I need to play safe, sadly. So we're going to be able to play it first, though. That's good. Or choose a tactic. I don't have... I think I take Korn's favor here. Or uh, whom, the, whom the bell tomes. Definitely have to do this. Kill you. Well, now... That's... That would be... Six. That would be five. Ten damage. Ten damage off of this, that, and... Yeah, that would be 13. I'm missing two damage here. Yeah, you can kill that. Go ahead and kill it. We're both low on cards. Well, not, he's not anymore. He's definitely gonna play a troop here. I can live with that. I can kill it. We're taking some damage. I need to get you to 10 to kill you. I don't take the risk. I'm sure he's got Macrage on her for sure in hand, so... We're gonna have to, you know... We're just gonna have to go through his stuff. Who counters Teal? Teal is 30 HP. Any aggro, real aggro, like I'm talking Karn, Dar, even Dar amazing. I think Dar right now is great. I would fuck him, okay. You can't let that live. If you do that, you just lost. You lost. If you don't, if you let that live, you lost. Why would you? Why wouldn't you? Okay. <laughs> Well, I guess we just win now, boys. Any regrets? Oh, silence, I guess. Like, why would you not kill that? I'm Raven Guard. Even if I didn't have Korn's favor, I could definitely kill that. Or I could kill you, probably. Even, like, I did not do the math, but that was... Like, that was not that great of a How play. How about that? Another one. Is that the same guy? Ultramarines for the wins. That's not the same guy. Uh, we want to keep you, but not really, because this guy's he can't have some early game. We're keeping Crucial Choice, because Crucial Choice, like you said, with Corex, uh, like you see, so guys, it's very good with Corex. So, uh, we actually want Guerrilla Warfare for the uh, control, and we keep being aggressive. There's not a lot of warriors I'm not aggressive with Corex. Only aggro, pure aggro. I will. Otherwise, I will be pretty annoying. Very fucking annoying. Uh, let's get crucial choice in. Yes, this is a good choice. All of those are good. All of those, well, Bible and not so. Execution is good, but Architect of Erezy, that I can steal one of those guys that he gets so big. You see, you, you've seen in the previous game, one of those guys that became so big. If I can just steal him, now he's got to use some, some, some of his jams, some of his, you know. So definitely just keep, keep get that. Another drilling side. Uh, not drilling side. Well, well, he played drilling side anyway. What's she playing? What's she doing here? What's your game? Burned a lot of cards this. Uh, this. Yeah, we're killing you now. But you're gonna trigger courage off of some bullshit. Do so. I play you? I don't think I let you. Do I? Can hit their play apothecary in this. We're killing you. Always think of the fucking ap uh, apothecary that he can play. That can be a real piece of shit. So, is Dar good now? Uh, I made the Dar be uh, deck earlier when uh, Ultramarines just got buffed. And it, it slapped. It slapped. It was pretty good. So, uh, I, I did per uh, share it in uh, our Discord. So, if you want to check that out, you can. Uh, that's annoying. Let's see what we got here. Hit for three. Fuck. That would have been good here. Uh, we, we're, we're still going to be aggressive. We're not gonna win in the very long game, I don't think so. So now if you play Apothecary, I will be sad. Of course you play. Please attack me. Okay. Okay. Well, I still don't kill that though. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna steal it next turn. Do I take the damage here? I'm not. I would have loved to play that and that, but fucked. Uh don't want to take too much damage here. We're just gonna take do that here. Go stealth, and hopefully he doesn't drop any other big guy. And I steal this. If I steal that, I'll be pretty happy. Yeah, no worries, Fredericks. Not a problem, bud. Yep, 
That's that's good. Should have buffed him though. You should have buffed him. That would have been good for me. Okay, so now he's gonna kill it, of course, but he's that gets that off the board. So now he will probably shoot it for five, kill it with uh, its face, and I take some damage anyway. So. But that should be at least I got rid of one of those. Probably has another one in there. Hey, oh, what's up? How you doing, Megatronus? Doing good, buddy. I'm doing a bit of Legion here. See what the. Wow. Fuck, that's another big boy. At least I can stealth off of that and play more dirt them. So I feel good. That feels good to play this. We got a big stealth guy on. Now we can be. We can pick his uh, board apart, I think. Hey, man, how's it going? What's up, Robber's Moon? How you doing, buddy? We're just. Uh, Playing Ultramarines over and over again, you know. <laughs> it's uh, a lot of fun. A lot of fun. So, I don't want to take too much damage, obviously, but I'm pretty sure he's got uh, the fucking Merciless in hand, so... I'm thinking just play this. Play that here. And we're gonna get our... Uh... Yeah, it's good to get that now. Like, the earlier the better, but I couldn't earlier, uh, obviously, because he, he had so many of sh so many shit going, just... By the way, Robber's Moon, I'm playing your favorite uh, stealth boys, but I'm not playing uh, Sharokin, though. I'm playing the big boy. Yup, I figured that was gonna happen, but you're gonna take some damage here. Okay, never mind. You're gonna drilling side into shooting it. Get another card, because courageous. Card for some reason. It didn't matter there was... Anyway, it was killing it, so it would have draw it anyway, so... Um, no choices here but to shoot it. I kind of want to establish a board here. So. It's not too bad. It's not too bad, okay? I've seen worse. I've seen worse. Like, if you play Stellock, this dies, so this doesn't. Okay, you're gonna draw a card. What are you fishing for? Belloc? Another Merciless. Okay. Both of those gone. Can I kill that though? Uh, I can. Oh, I'm not sending that back to hand. I'm gonna use a lot of resources here, but uh, I got no choices. I just got no choices. Uh, gonna use you here. No. At least those are gone. That's good. All those gone, I stand a better chance. Because those are the big boys. And now if he drops like, another fucking Apothecary, I can just send him back to hand and do some good damage here. Yeah, you're drawing a card. Mantle of Ultramar, interesting. I'm playing that guy next so I can draw some cards when this dies. Obviously, he does. Okay. First of all, play this. Get a card. I'm keeping that guy here. Playing you. You go here. Deal some damage. Deal some more damage. Okay, we're feeling good. We're feeling good, boys. We're feeling pretty good. Let's see. Now he's gonna uh, use. He's gonna have to use his uh, gem on that. I'm pretty sure. So shoot it for five. Gem it. Oh, finally you got Inferman Network. This dies. I draw a card. Cool. Shoot it. Shoot him. Okay. 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 You're you're not doing anything else that turn really. Maybe drawing another card. I'm drawing a card. Deliverance. Good. That was his only en only empty stealth, I'm pretty sure. Unless he, he generates one, so... We're gonna draw... Cards. Good. We're gonna set up le Lethal here. We're gonna set up Lethal. Because I'm pretty sure he doesn't have another empty stealth. I'm pretty sure... Like, right now, he could play Stalock, though. That's the only thing saving him. Okay, well... I'm pretty sure I still win that. Uh, do I? Send that back to Anne. Yup. Pretty sure we got this. I'm not doing the full math, because I'm fucking lazy as fuck, but, uh... I'd be very surprised if I don't kill him. I'm pretty sure we just fucking kill him. Yup. Alright, two Ultramarines in a row, two Gage in a row, two wins in a row. That was good. Lander Leo, 2043 and 1. Alpha Legion. 
Uh, I'm not a big fan of Alpha Legions. I don't like playing them. Kind of boring and uh, very tedious gameplay. Uh, we don't want you. We don't want you. That's better. That is better. I hate this matchup, but it's winnable. It is definitely winnable, boys. Oh, you're actually playing Ingo Peck. Wow. Interesting. Fuck. I haven't seen that guy in forever. So if you're playing Ingo Peck, I think we're being uh, aggressive here. Let's get them uh, as down, uh, as low as possible. Oh, uh, I hope you just kill that, then I can play this and you don't do anything. Yeah, you can play better in supply. That is totally fine by me, bud. Okay. Apothecary Coleman, draw more cards. Good. I like this little guy. A lot of people don't like him. I like this little guy. He's annoying for the enemy to deal with. In most cases. And he can get you some uh, pretty good, decent damage. That's fine. I'm not going to attack with that. I'm just going to heal, probably. I'm just gonna heal. Jesus Christ. I'm pretty sure one of those is, uh... Yeah, okay. Uh... Let's play you. Yep, I figured that was gonna happen, but I prefer this to die here. So. Actually won't. Like, those are all good choices, but... I think we kind of want Deliverance, mostly. I'm pretty sure you're going to stun me at the end of my turn, so I'm going to heal. Yep, I figured that was going to happen. I figured. So now you could play something annoying, but I next turn I get to play Dayton. That should be good. Okay, you're making me draw. You're far from Arrow and range, so that should be good. Use counterattack right now, and you're gonna stun us? No, you're gonna heal. Weird. And you're still gonna create one of... Okay, you're gonna create a trap. Okay, so you're playing traps now. Uh, we play you here. Actually, do that. Do I get rid of the secret order? I think I do. Taking three damage is not the end of the world. And I don't mind it. I don't mind it. If he shoots it and stun it, and kills it, I don't mind it really that much. I just want I want I want him to spend resources on that so I can chill. Okay, now you're just playing a whole lot bunch of stuff. What's going on? Okay, but uh, don't kill that I don't. You're just gonna kill this though. Two archery strikes, but you don't kill that. Nope. Okay. Get some damage in. Pretty sure he kills that with whatever like definitely like that's a weird build artillery strikes and stuff that's a very weird build. very weird okay we're fishing for something and satellite don't kill that come on i want to get of course you killed you damage your face annoying very fucking annoying another one of those though pretty good uh we're gonna keep that i think just gonna shoot you Hopefully he doesn't got Exodus in there. That would be pretty annoying. Next turn is the Harrowing, so I gotta do the best. I gotta use the best of my science here. Fuck. Next turn, Harrowing. That sucks. I am on too much cards. What did I play? I don't remember. Can I get under five cards? And play one, two, three. I can I can get under five cards, I think. Yeah, I think I can get under five cards. No, can I? I'm gonna play you like all of you four five. I'll be on. Can you make me draw? I think I think we take the chance here. I think I think I think we take the chance and get under the cards value. Like, you go here, you get over there, you get over there, you use that here, 
I actually forgot that this makes me makes me us. That was a bad play, boys. Don't do what I did there. That was a bad play. Very bad play, I think. Because now Arrow and kills all my shit. I don't take as much damage though, so that's kind of fine. Come on, do it. I know you've got it. Or you play that guy. I'm gonna I'm gonna have to deliverance here. Not sending that back to hand. But now, I'm pretty sure I can get on third a number of uh, six. Yep. Put it there. I'm gonna hit you here. Now, he will kill all my shit, except for this, which is the only thing I care about. That's fine. Yup, Arrow one. Yup, that's fine. That's actually fine. Absolutely fine. Okay. I'm low on cards, kinda. Uh, not on cards, on health, but so he, so is he, so. That shouldn't be too bad, okay, boys? That shouldn't be too bad. Can you kill me? If you got Exodus, I'll be pissed. Okay, you can heal. And you're gonna stun that? You're gonna, you're gonna shoot me and stun it, though. Go. No, I don't think I can quite kill you. Can hit there. If you have Exodus, I would be pretty pissed, but... Okay, let's see. Very fucking enough. I might just be dead now. Five. That depends. Shoots me for four again. I'm on... Yeah. I, I, I think I lost that. I think I lost that. I'm pretty sure I lost that. Okay, what are you fishing? Your tactic that shoots me? You're actually stunning that guy here, okay? Fair enough. Hit for four? That's kind of annoying. I'm not going to lie, guys. That is very annoying. And of course, you got Exodus off of that. And now I'll just lose. Uh... I wasn't far, though. I wasn't far. I really wasn't far. But him getting Exodus too. But anyway, I didn't have anything. Uh, I didn't draw any more damage. But I was close. I was very close. Both draw almost all our decks. That was a good play by him. That was a good play. Shit happens, it's fine. Proctor, are you serious? I haven't seen that guy since the nerf they made like a year ago. Holy shit. Definitely want to keep coming, Bridge. And those guys. No, not those guys. Those guys. Okay, well... This is a matchup I've really been... I've been played in forever. Yeah, this has to be Blackout. You know what's funny? I actually talked to Blackout uh, yesterday over voice... Uh, over a call, over a phone. He's doing great, but he's not playing this game ever again. <laughs> he's never playing that game again, sadly. But that, that would have been funny. If it was Blackout, that would have been pretty fun. Him getting that kind of sucks, though. I'm not... That really is not... Can't kill it too. On this here. No, that's actually. Okay, all right, all right. Let's see. Let's see what you've got for me, bud. Okay, and you're gonna create another guy. I'm gonna play Apothecary. That's good for me. Him on on five six with this guy is pretty annoying though. We play you. We still kill that. You're pretty annoying. Now you could play something big for six. You could you could play the eight seven Kappa motherfucker or Death of Innocence. Okay, now I gotta be quick on shit now. At, at least this dies. Oh, come on, man. Okay, uh, we are actually gonna play that over here. Play you. 
get rid of you here. And we're gonna get rid of your little shitty guy here. Okay. Alright, alright. Now you're on six. You could play something annoying. You could play that fucking card that gives you four units across the board. That would be very annoying for me. Another death of innocence. Now this is a race. I need to kill him as as fast as I can. You're not even killing you're not even killing that. Okay. I can play Dayton next. Play you. Hit over there. Hit you. We're actually gonna go face with the apothecary in case something happens. So now he could play like I don't think I'm fucked, because I can always stealth off of most of his shit. But now he's gonna drop things that becomes big. Like fucking big. Like that guy that I'll just probably just throw back to your hand. And I'll do a bunch of damage. I'll just kill that instead. You're gone. You're back to hand. You give sentence. And we do a bunch of damage. And we're actually gonna use that guy here to attack. Just to get him very fucking low. Okay. Well, I don't wanna say that I win, but I'm pretty yeah, I'm pretty sure I win, okay? This is why Proctor's not good. Like, he didn't have a bad start, but Jesus Christ, his ability sucks and it's so easy to get rid of. Dropping those 1-1 one -one guys? What the fuck do you think is gonna happen, right? So, like, this is just bad world right now, like, where's my beer at, for fuck's sake?